как обычно, блядь. Ебалась она в рот. Всем привет, команда 3F Models на Бухаре Саммит. Лухари лаю, блядь. Заняла депутата 5000 долларов. Ну прикинь. Why you let these motherfucking clones on my throne? Bitch, get up, daddy's home. Let it be known. All through these in the streets, when niggas buy. Out of eye and fucking traffic, where we collide. All I know up in this world is to survive. Take his money, take his girl, and take his life. But I don't wanna, all I wanna do is bend the corner through the avenues without running up against the ooze. Mama, get the bad news. Cousins already begging for my tennis. Треф модул все еще на бухаре саммите. Как вы можете видеть, апгрейд произошел два флажка. И дача Логан. Добро пожаловать в Румынию, детки. Ну так держится за того мужика, будто его кто-то увидел, она его видела. I'm Christina. I'm the CEO of Rishgar Studios. Uh, Rishgar Studios is one of the one of the biggest studios in the industry. Uh, we are we are um, uh, multiple winners of uh, many awards in the industry. We have uh, three studios in Bucharest, and uh, we are like 16 years old now on the market. So yeah, <laughs> quite veterans, I would say. How many models now you have? Uh, we have over 100 models now. Over 100. Models. We know you have a lot of top models. Can you tell our viewers uh, your best top model with your best earning in the month? Well, that depends from the period to the period, and I would like to keep secret the, the earnings of, of the models, but they were definitely in uh, the top of the websites. Uh, and they want to keep private their uh, their incomes it's yeah okay. and anyway this is relative i mean they can be in the top one period but then if you don't uh, keep up uh, keep up with the hard work then it's very very easy to go down oh. <laughs> yeah your favorite site uh, well we work on multiple campsites and we like very much jasmine we like streammate we work on camps also we very much like flirt for free uh, so, so you yeah, premium side. I, I prefer. Yeah, actually, we used to work on premium size, but now we are very open to work on the premium size also because the the models are quite different. So we are trying to tailor uh, an account, you know, that it's compatible with the model. So we're gonna start to work on premium also. Hi, uh, we are Unicorn Agency. We are based in Bucharest, but we also have uh, uh, a studio in Russia. I'm sorry, I don't do English today. <laughs> yeah. And we have uh, like 15 years experience, yeah, so we're kind of old. Um, we are friendly, we love our models, we are trying to make the best of it for the models. We are doing our uh, ultimate best, so our models are very, very successful. And um, yeah, we, we're here and uh, visit us. <laughs> How many models now you have? Uh, a few hundred. Oh. Uh, can you tell our viewers biggest earning of the model in the months? Um, our biggest models have, I don't know how, what to tell you, like 10,000 per month, around, around that. It's, uh, it's a great. Your favorite side? My favorite side? Yeah. I, I don't want to be... What's going to happen if I pick one? Uh, <laughs> your studio working more with freemium or premium? Both, both. We, uh, we try to base our sites on uh, each model, so we are making the best for the model. It depends on what the model wants and what the, uh, they're comfortable with, you know? It's cool. Thank you much. Please, our viewers, who are you and about the company? Uh, uh, hi, my name is Alicia and I'm head of community. I'm part of CAM 101 by Lovens, that is the platform that we have created to connect with the CAM models and it's a 
educational platform for models. Yeah. You may made a big solution for the models. You can make money with the sex toys. What else are real Slovenes can make? Well, I mean, I think it's it's a bit of both, and then it's like imagination is so important, right? It's like you have like home stuff. You can use this for like creating your own business, and all the toys can make you like create your own coming empire, right? It's like sky is the limit. But yeah, like you can always come with more ideas and things that we can, we can do. Like we are always developing new software and uh, new apps and new ideas for like the models, but also for the people at their home. So it can be a bit of balance, right? Who more buys toys? Like uh, usual people or webcam models? For us, webcam models, we think. You created idea, toys react on the members' tokens. How it start? Well, actually it started more from the like the long distance relationship mm -hmm. of the founder of the company. So he was in love. Yeah. Like love and comes from love. So like he was in love, he was in a long distance relationship and he really wanted to be able to connect with the partner that they are living like so far apart. So that was the very beginning and from there till today like going with the cam models. That in the end it's also like some kind of long distance relationship, right? How many press and student models use it? Like we know about no nude models who not using toys but on your opinion how many present now using it? I think like most models right now they are using the toys because they know like I mean even in the major sites you have a Lovens category like it's one of the most search uh, like names that you are gonna find there when you're like typing so I think every model and every person who's starting this business they think like it's an essential part of the job so I think like most of models they use it now like yeah. What goals uh, you have for the future? Well, I think the goals are like still like support models, cam models are super important for us, create more software and toys that make the like this business easier for the models, make everything easier, intuitive, like actually easier to use, like for everybody who starts from the very beginning and like more creative toys that they are gonna help you have a better show and then find the way to give you all the support that everybody needs like when you are in every job but like in, especially in this one many people don't know about your new toys because they know only Lush and Domi Nora and all so tell uh, viewers about new you stuff see them? Yep. I have yep. Them here. yep so like you can use it like this like it has like a suction cup so you can just like attach to different surface oh. and it's like a thrusted and vibrator so it's like, it's like this oh now it's trusted it's like a little fuck machine with vibrate. Yeah, literally, yeah. it's like a portable fuck machine. Yeah, yeah. So if you see, it has like this kind of movement. Oh, yeah. It's like a fingering movement. It's not like, uh, it also has vibration, but you can just like feel it. But it, it has like a, a little extra, right? Your bra. Like but it's, yeah, actually, when I ca like when I have it in the carry-on in my luggage, like people think that this is going to be yeah, like, yeah. yeah. Like headphones for running for something. Yeah. We will not lie girls like Lovens and all the stuff <laughs> not only for money <laughs> yeah thank you much for the interview it was very interesting thank it was you. lovely to meet you thank you thank you just to be self-confident you know. <laughs> are you and about the company so we are the warehouse X, the warehouse located in Estonia and we are waiting all of you in the warehouse X, the world famous warehouse X. So what do we do? Is a uh, can we move it there? It's our website. So it's a uh, warrior real life camps, hidden camps, and camps originally. And what do we do? Is uh, let's go here. You can watch the girls from different angles. You can chat. You can do whatever you want. You can give them tips for that. Oh, it's like spying. It is. Oh. It is. You are right. And even now, it's 24 7, by the way, online. Every time of day, you can see from the different rooms, from different cameras, what the girls are doing. Can you tell us the uh, biggest earning of the model? Well, it's more than 10 grand for the month, and it's uh, even the fact that we are only seven months on the market.
so less than one year and we are already making some good earnings for our models and we also earn from that that's why we are here I know a lot of men's like paying girl just uh, she put some camera on her apartment for the pine yeah. so it's and, a and, cool here, and here is full biggest apartment in the world with a lot of cameras actually uh, it's like a model house yeah we can say it so there are only models and this is a really big house with a, a lot of cameras but actually come on the new level TikTok house now it's webcam house yeah. <laughs> how you see world famous in the future uh, generally we want to open more warehouses actually we want to be everywhere in the world and we want to give uh, the to provide the job opportunity for the models that's uh, our main goal for now and if we reach it we will continue doing what we do where girls can find you like in uh, which one um, in countries we are right now located in Estonia so we are inviting all the girls who are watching this video to Estonia to visit warehouse X and we will we will be waiting for you there thank you much for the interview <laughs> thank you too. it's a, a reality show I'm a freak to the core, get a dose once, you gon' want some more My tongue touch a girl, your toes bound to curl This exclusive stick, I don't share with the world I had y'all up early in the morning, morning Back shot, crap with a low, can't stop us Been a fiend for this, it's rockin' me Hits, get the position down, back, then it's time to switch I rock the boat, I work the minute I speed it up, straight beat it up And I ain't in the hood with my toes out low I'm in the telly working up a sweat stroke. Tonight's the night. You can fall in love. You can call your mama right now. Tell her you met a dog. Uh, hi viewers, I'm Andra, the head of business development for StripChat. How did you get into the webcam industry? Uh, I got into the webcam industry ten, almost 10 years ago. I started working with uh, a cam studio from Romania and I was doing their marketing, PR, um, franchising and everything. So I started with that. So I have a lot of... Um, a lot of training with the models. I've learned how to manage models and I know what they need, what studio models need as well. Um, and because of the, the studio that I was working with was international, I got the opportunity to meet so many models from not only Romania, but Russia, uh, Ukraine, uh, Colombia, United States, Prague and everywhere. So yeah, that's how I started 10 years ago with a studio. Now I've, I'm here. <laughs> You choose uh, strip chat as a pain better than uh, before your companies. If they pay, pay, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, I love strip chat. I've been, I've been, too, so. I love strip chat. It's, um, I've been seeing, I saw the platform uh, from the moment that it started, from its, uh, from its early days. And I love the technology behind it. I love the way that the people thought and, you know, worked on, on the technology to make the platform so good, both for the models for the users and for the studios that are that are doing that are working on it. Strip chat very young site, less than ten years, but already but already strip chat on the top. So how do you think some another young sites uh, can make same level <laughs> be so fast on the top like strip chat? Ah, you're asking me for the secret recipe to strip chat. Mm -hmm. um, I think uh, I think it's a, it's a combination. It's a combination of new and improved technology, um, improving what is already here in, in regards of sh streaming technology, let's say, understanding users and understanding what the models want. Um, to be honest, there are so many campsites out there. So just study them. And it's the same thing that I would tell a model that wants to start streaming on any site. Study the market, see what's good, see what you want, see what's good and what's, you know, what's, what's good for you. Uh, do you know highest uh, earning from the studios or some models on the strip chat of the old time? To be honest, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know this information. Um, 
there's that's not you can see it in the top like you have we have our top models uh, category so you can see yeah. like what are the the top earners there um i think any model is you know one of our top because they're on strip chat so for me everybody is a princess and a, a goddess what are your plans for the future how do you see yourself in five ten years uh, will you stay in webcam industry a hundred percent a hundred percent a hundred a hundred percent there is nothing nothing more that i like than than the webcam industry than than the adult industry in itself it is so welcoming to everyone there is not there's no i mean there is competition but there's fair competition and everybody is we're all working in for the same things and us ourselves as people you know you can't really talk about this industry with everybody outside if you're like just let's say you're you're working at a gas station you can tell anyone about it and they're gonna understand but for us in the web in, in the adult industry it's pretty hard to talk to people because they don't really understand so what is it? Yeah. It is, right? <laughs> it's just the fact that, you know, we're all people that are connected by the same goals and by the same love for, for what we're doing, either helping performers, either helping um, users, or, if, you know, it's, I think it's a lovely industry to be in. Our industry much deeper than yeah. I'll think. <laughs> can uh, can say to our viewers how they can uh, come to strip chat team and be a part of strip chat. Oh, okay. Well, it depends on what you want to do. Uh, but we're always we're always looking for for new people in the team, for good people in the team. If you are a developer, if you are, if you like, uh, you know, you like to work, if you are a dedicated person, if you're open minded, most likely we're going to have a job for you. If you're a cool person that knows their, what they're doing, just apply and we're going to find something for you. You will be part of Strip <laughs> Chat. Thank you much for the interview. Thank you so you much. I really love your work. Thank you. Wait, it's a cool. Paka, paka. <laughs> Did I say it right? Is that how you yeah, say it? Yeah, right. Paka, paka. You can try on the Ukrainian. How's that? Buvai. 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 <laughs> Thank you. Uh, so please introduce yourself to our viewers. I am Little Red Bunny, an independent cam artist uh, since 2009. And that's it. <laughs> I don't know. I also created my Little Red Bunny Academy as a mentor. Um, and consultation also for companies and platforms or companies are peripheral to the camming as well. How did you start coming? I realized well, I was working 12 hours a day, so I'm like, oh my God, I've been there 14 hours, I didn't see time go by, and then I just work every day. That crazy schedule for many, many yep. years. <laughs> did you try to be on the studio and European opinion about studios? I visited studio, but I always, <laughs> I've always with my academy or as friends, because uh, I, I've been traveling to uh, Romania um, and Colombia for many years, like since 2015. So uh, I don't see myself working for a studio. Once you know, you used to, I started from myself. I don't mm -hmm. see how I would now use a studio because I've done everything on my own since so long. Um, but I can see for some people it can be beneficial for them to work in a studio because like I have to hire for photography, I have to hire for help and I have to take care of all that by myself. Uh, you have a photographer, manager, what about Sexter? Do you use it or you, sh you do it by yourself? I do not have a manager. <laughs> I'm the manager and the boss. Oh. <laughs> but I do outsource. I do hire someone for photography, sometimes to do the, I used to do all the editing myself mm -hmm. of the picture Photoshop and all this, uh, but now I have someone that I bring on trips with me so he can do videos and then I can create fun on everything. So I'm still the one that's going to post all my tweets. I'm the You're one You're still that's working gonna, by yourself. I still do everything. It's going to help me sometimes to just get new ideas and it's going to pitch me. What are the most successful months or period you have in your webcam career? You remember it? I beat you should. All models remember her biggest tip and her biggest month. I did have my biggest tip that was $21,000 oh. and 300. Uh, yeah, 21300 from one member and he gave it while I was in free chat and I didn't do anything. He didn't ask for anything. He's someone that normally just privates me, but 
I helped him to, we were talking and like, like psychology. Um, we talk about personal things, but also he, he like, he was creating, um, he liked to play games, like role play games and stuff like that. So I was, we were just talking, having a drink and I'm like, oh, you could do something like that. And then he was doing draw, drawings for characters. He was playing Dungeon and Dragon and he was the master or, and so he was doing designs and we were talking about it and then he started to have an idea to do a, a job. I owe that to you. So he was so thankful and he just, he did that amount once to give 16,000 something another time. It, but it was just being thankful and that was sweet. <laughs> Have you ever thinking about open your studio? No, like I said, it's a different culture in America. I don't think it would work. Uh, we are very independent and women in general and people have, a, it's really big to be a self-employee and work for your own self. Um, and as soon, how, how it would work with the mentality is that as soon they would maybe get the, the idea of how that works, they would right away do it at their home. Like, What are your plans for the future? I will continue coming, I love it. <laughs> I always keep my eyes open. I, I'm the kind that don't go with a schedule and I I just try to always keep creative to create my own project because if things don't come to me, I normally try to find, okay, I need something new. I want, and that's how I came up with the academy and then with projects I did with that. I, I still love what I do and I still like to think of that things will happen and we grow as people. So what I thought I would do a year, like I said, I thought I would not camp more than a week and I ended up doing I'm 14 years later, I'm still here. So you never know, keep your eyes open and mind open for anything. And the last question, how you see webcam in 10 years? <laughs> and then again, <laughs> funny, because a few years ago... Still with me. A <laughs> few years ago, I thought it would be more and more intimate and more and more increasing the... I'd say how interactive we would be thinking that uh, even with the interactive toy that happened. So I think it would come back a little bit from going, being so out in public with the influencers and the TikTok and all the fan sites. I think it went back to doing content, which actually is closer to what porn was. And camming became popular and cam was, um, porn was fading because cam was the thing was that we're interactive. And now what happened is like, we go back to porn. where we stole from. Yeah. We go back to the porn where it's not interactive that much actually. And it's like, so it might come back to that. Uh, I hope it will before like I'm too old to camp. <laughs> we hope to. Thank you much for the interview. Thanks to you. You're already mm -hmm. cool. Thank you much. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> 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 I just wanna have a good night, hold up If you don't know, now you know If you broke, then you gotta let him go You could have anybody, any money, mo Cause when you a boss, you could do what you want Yeah! Shake my eye, 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 eye. Show, show my thong, thong Do, do my thing, thing Ain't nothing wrong, ain't nothing wrong Go girl, go girl, go girl, go girl Go girl, go girl, go girl, go girl Dum, 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 the city I'm from is covered with federals That'll make your crew run, run, your crew run, run It's next to come, um Dum, diddy, dum, dum, my time's now The city I'm from is covered with federals That'll make your crew run, run, your crew run, run It's next to come, um Back in your home Boy, you kill this one, dog. <laughs> baby, keep moving that thing, baby, keep moving that thing I wanna take it to the boom, boom, boom So I don't think it's not a test, DJ Bring it, bring it back, bring it, bring it, bring it back Я потребить. Что вы такое? Полетели.
16, I sold the dope face. Not yet a drug dealer, but I watched it closely. Until they noticed me, I got the feds wondering who broke the law. Fuck who inhibited for gun smoke, I broke this jaw. Words harder than a fucking diamond. Mobile phone call to sign a nigga dripping on me when we ride. Fuck them slowly like Jodeci. And stick a needle in my eye, I'll find a live and die for MOB. And fuck your homeboys, nigga, we can drop the gun. I hit your block and we can box for fun. Nigga, one on one, last to fall is a ball of cat. It's death row, why the fuck you think we call it that? So if you knew me in my past life, don't act like we homeboys. Ain't no love in the fast life. I switch gears on them jealous bitches, who do you fit? The game plan of a change man. So what I'm saying is... How did you find out about this fair and came to us? I found the studio by accident when I was looking for a job. The first studio that I came across on the internet was uh, 3F Models. I know you are a successful model. Tell a couple of secrets how you did it. First of all, you must always be real. Speaking with the members, not only chat like many models. In addition to your work shift, you have to communicate with the members in your free time. You are in Romania now. How did you get here? When the war started, my mother and me went to Romania, as the studio offered us the opportunity to work in Bucharest. The studio also provided accommodation and I stayed for a year in Bucharest. Tell me, how much you earn per month? In different ways, uh, six, seven thousand dollars. Tell me, what you managed to achieve with such earnings? In less than a year, I saved up for an apartment, which is now in Ukraine. <laughs> All safe there and good visit. Mom living uh, there now, uh, also bought a car, uh, which I have already successfully sold a few days ago. And I travel a lot, probably the most important thing that I wanted to come to work in studio is to earn money and travel. Give some advice to viewers, girls who want to start working but afraid. Um, of course, for this job you should know English. Love yourself, take care of yourself. Of course, you need to work, you need to have a willpower, not be lazy, work every day. Tell funny stories. We know that you lend money to deputies. You are actively involved in charity work. Charity helps the country, but um, never borrow money to deputize. <laughs> Tell the viewers how the members supported you during the war and how they helped our army. In the first months of the war, uh, since the studio uh, don't work, I started working from my laptop at home. Uh, the members were very supportive, gave me a lot of money, and of course the first two months I uh, don't do any shows. I just told about the whole situation, they worry about me and try help me and support. It was successful months, uh, they support Ukrainian army or during different military staff uh, for army from USA. Different military clothes, helmets, and sending money to me that I'm also ordering all this. Just how are models make money? <laughs> this is your best photo. I will not lie, I like your boobs. <laughs> Thank you. Tell our viewers, who are you? Hi, I'm Miss Caitlin Brooks. You can find me all over the place under MissCaitlinBrooks.com. How you came to webcam? How did I come into webcamming? Uh, kind of a crazy story. I went into fashion and merchandising and I fell in love with, you know, the female energy there. And then I went into being an art curator and an events coordinator at the Erotic Heritage Museum. So I had an art background, fell in love with all things art and eroticism and and got very close to the BDSM and kink community in Las Vegas. And I stumbled into adult sex work after that and took off with my brand. You work in BDSM, right, I hear? <laughs> um, I am a fetish and kink model. I do a lot of femdom, a lot of domination play. I'm on Streamate, so I'm a little bit of a chameleon and a little bit of a switch. I do a bit of everything. You just don't look like mistress. I 
supposed to be mistress on the side. So you look like cool Barbie girls, so cutie. So my whole brand is basically fuck you, pay me. I'm the hot cheerleader you wanted to have sex with in high school and had absolutely no fucking chance with. And guess what? You still don't. So you should be grateful that you get to breathe the same air as me. I see you fall in love with Webcom. I have. This industry, the people, the humans, the women, the energy is so amazing. Once I got into adult, there was no going back. Can you give some advice to our viewers how to become famous webcam model? Do it all. Everything that you're passionate about, everything you enjoy, like if you create content, don't stress that it's not perfect. Put it out there. Like your fans are going to love it. They're going to love seeing it. So just don't worry about being perfect. Just worry about creating as much content and putting your personality into it every single time. Thank you. I love her books like she like webcam. Ada vodichki dam. Plakhavasta. Хорошо. Нужно просто делать как наш оператор. Он выпивает пивас, запивает всё апиролем и видишь, посмотри на него. Он бодрее всех живых. Самый самый живой человек. Ты закладчик. Я потребитель. Что? Нет, да нет. Что, он это не, утро. Он не пьющий, он, он танцевал всю ночь. Ты танцевал всю ночь? Нет, ну ты что, не видел меня на сцене? Я не мог танцевать всю ночь, потому что я танцевал до утра. О, даже больше, даже больше. И тебе не понадобились тапочки, как мне? Нет, не понадобились, но в следующий раз я подумаю, может, даже Отойти. парочку возьму. Мужикам повезло. Ну, ты выглядишь свежо и бодро, в отличие от всех остальных. Есть особенный секрет бодрости. Ты не пьешь? Есть и другой особенный секрет бодрости. Нюхаешь? Не-не-не, заядка с утра и так далее, холодное обтирание, там все дела, ну, короче, нормально. Ты просто кокаин нюхаешь, скажи честно. Can you please tell our viewers who are you and about the site? Sure. Hi, I'm Shirley from Chatterbait. Um, I've been with the company since the very beginning. Uh, it feels like just yesterday we were just a startup. And when I mean startup, like to the T, a startup of four people uh, and having an idea, collaborating, and to where we are today, it's it's remarkable. 13 years later, uh, my official title is COO, um, but I feel like I do so much more than beyond. Uh, the COO type title um, but yeah in a nutshell that's me <laughs> what is the history of the chat rate uh, yeah, so one of the owners uh, of our company, this is kind of his baby, it was is his vision. And um, at the time I was running a bunch of solo girl sites. And solo girl sites, um, for people who don't know what that means, it means like a, a pay site that's based around one person. And uh, solo girl sites were already doing cam shows for their members. Um, so when I was onboarded, the idea was to get those people and create a community of like-minded people. Um, Chatterbait was kind of the first to the market with the whole freemium concept. And it's been really interesting to see the creativity of our platform. Uh, we have mothers on the platform. We have um, uh, college students on the platform. We have transgender. We have uh couples, men, and they're all on the homepage. We don't discriminate um, on our homepage. If you're an interesting person and our community finds you interesting, the better your ranking. Which one new products uh, we can expect? So maybe some offline platform from the chat rebate will be or something like this? Yeah, um, we're going to be improving our direct messages. Um, so basically um, what you see now, it's going to be enhanced. Um, also another thing that's in the pipeline is auto tweets. So when you jump on uh, broadcast, uh, you'll be able to create like, uh, take a quick snapshot and have it uploaded into the system and it will do an auto tweet uh, and it will include your affiliate link so you can get affiliate revenue. Can you tell us biggest tip on the chat rebate ever? Um, one that comes to mind that happened recently was someone was tipped $25,000 and uh, we were ecstatic and we were like, wait a minute, is this fraud? So when we looked at it, um, we were like, oh my gosh, it, you know, the, it was 
made through wires. There is no fraud with wires. Um, so it was pretty remarkable. I asked uh, the broadcaster if we can put it on social because it was such a milestone. And of course, she said no. The tipper said no. So it's quite funny you know, that we have these really big tips that no one gets to hear about, but they happen. How have you seen webcam in 10 years? Oh my gosh, I think each chat room is going to become more personalized. You kind of already see it now with the ability to um, have like different ad themes and, and kind of personalize your own chat room. But I think that's going to be further embedded. One of the things that Chatterbait did is launch Events API, and that also allows broadcasters to um, make their own tipping sounds, you know? So it, it's going to be more personalized. I don't see this market um, slowing down. Down. If anything, it, it's definitely getting started. Give three advices for be success on the chat way. Um, number one, be happy. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> really, you know, um, don't think, don't let society think like the skinny girl's the hottest. That's so not true. Um, you know, society's perception of what hotness is is not everyone's perception. So be proud of your body, no matter what your body looks like. Be happy and be proud of what you got. Um, so that's suggestion number two. And suggestion number three is consistency. Um, consistency goes a long way on our platform. Thank you much for your interview. Thank, Thank you, you for having me. <laughs> Bye. Thank you much. There you go. Мне продолжать будет заплачиваться. Хорошо, если я там буду уродом, помни. Я буду твоей совести. Hi. Hello. Tell please our viewers who are you. My stage name is Coach Carl, and I have been a live cam broadcaster for 10 years. I have been a porn producer for 35 years. And the industry isn't quite sure what to make of me because a lot of my work is very soft work with other models and that's a genre that people like. When you decide working with pornography, webcoming, when it was the first time in your head? I had been involved in television since high school. So by the time that I made my first video in 1986, I had been working in television quite a while. And because I work with content with men, men, males, boys, you know, whatever the industry term is. In the mid-80s, we were going through a health crisis, and people were scared. <laughs> for, for good reason, they were scared, because there were no medical treatments. So many years, my parents even don't plan uh, to have me while you start. <laughs> and you still love this fair and still keep going? Well, absolutely. There's new. There, there's new customers, viewers, turning 18 every day, and so our industry needs to be aware that tomorrow there's going to be thousands of new customers turning 18 who have grown up with COVID lockdowns and all of the craziness of wars and political battles and they come to us for entertainment and for escape and maybe they can't have friends in person but they can have friends on the screen how you see future of webcam in five ten years well it changed in the last year where prior to now prior to a year ago 
we all picked a CAM platform that we wanted to be a part of. There, back then there were maybe five, and now there's 10 to 15. But back then you picked one and you only did one and you stuck with one. Over the last year especially, viewers have found different personalities on the different campsites. So they'll go to one, which is very conservative. They'll go to another where they know they don't ever have to spend a tip. Thank you much for the interview. Thank and thank you. thank you. You're doing a wonderful job. You're doing it better. <laughs> long, long time. Не смеяться над Софией. Не смеяться над Софией. Если в следующих выпусках я буду красивее, знайте, румыны помогли мне. У меня нет денег на косметику. Угорать над Софией. Опа. Заберешь нам пакетик, так что вы на роли будешь красивее. Да собирайтесь, я сейчас просто хавать пойду. Просто Не надейся, там уже почти ничего нет. Присели. Опа. Ну не пиздите на меня, все Смотри, хорошо. Есть... Я, 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 я хочу ширмочку. Все так, молодец, сколько там набрала уже мерча? Я? Да. Да хуя. А ты? Я на всю страну взял. Ну, у вас она, да, сокращается каждый день. Я надеюсь, тебя не загребут, и я тебя где-то под бахву там, блядь, не найду. Полетели. Опа. Все, зай бог. Погнали. Погнали. А мне вообще все заново? Старый вот и подошел к концу Бухарест Саммит. Это были безумно насыщенные три дня. Безумная, безумная благодарность Бухарест Саммиту за то, что было очень много красивой груди и очень мало лысых голов мужиков. Спасибо вам за красивых девушек. Это было очень продуктивно. Мы работали не покладая рук и печени. Вы это все сами видели. И теперь главное. Обязательно лайкайте, подписывайтесь на нас и оставляйте комментарий. Так как в инстаграме вас ждет розыгрыш. За лучший комментарий вы получите набор мерча всех сайтов. Вы видели, сколько мы набрали, поэтому подарки будут очень крутые.